let's just do the opening first. What are we thinking um, in terms of the Gamba? What do you want to Gamba on when it comes to Battles of Legends? Should we Gamba on whether we get the Utopia or what? Uh, Gamma 0302, think of it as seven months. How about some remote Edison? I mean, we can try that at some point. As, as soon as my, like, my remote setup isn't finished yet. Like, we've, we've already been doing remote setups, but I am currently getting, like, assets made for it. Like, overlays and stuff. So it's going to look a lot cleaner soon, hopefully. Uh, and once that's done, like, remote content, we can do, we can do whatever. Like, if you guys want to see me play Edison... Like, we can invite, like, we can invite, like, I don't know, E3 or Carpath or whatever. Like, we can play some Edison uh, with some popular Edison creators as well. I mean, I have all the Edison decks pretty much. So, yeah. We can do, um, we can do that too at some point. Or Waver, yeah. All right, I'm going to make a prediction on do we pull, do we pull the Utopia? Simple. Do we pull the Utopia? Yes, no. And uh, just for context, we have... We do have... Once again, shoutouts to, shout to SmartGuard for, for sending me these whenever they come out. We have one, uh, one of these, right? One of these, which is eight... Eight boxes. So just so you can evaluate your odds and calculate your odds for the Gamba perfectly. <laughs> we have uh, we have eight of these boxes, which I think they have two packs each. All right. All in on no. I mean, I don't know what the odds are for the Utopia. I, I do not know what the odds are for the Utopia. So that's that's on you. You're on your own. All right. Uh, I have already, uh, like, there's a thing, I've already uh, made a cut through the, the thingies here, um, but I haven't looked inside yet, just so we wouldn't have to struggle with it during stream. So we have eight of these, uh, and once again, uh, stuff that I don't need, we're gonna give away. These are German, uh, usually they send me English, but these are German this time, so we can have some fun with some German names. We'll see how it goes. All right, let us begin. Is the Gamba still running? No, okay. All right, and here we go. And our first promo. By the way, the way these are the way these are in here is a little weird because, like, there's this area here, right between these two flaps. Or whatever it's called and like the cart doesn't fit in in this like I, I don't know it's weird anyways we've gotten i don't know what the english name of this card is okay you guys can't okay okay can you focus there you go bro janitor is that, I, what are the good promos in this? I for gore. And we have a Stratos dice. Which is cool, I suppose. You know what? Let me get all of them out. Let me get all of them out, because I want to know if I get a JD dice. I really want that JD dice. Alright, second box. We have Dark Armed. That's actually a good one. That used to be an expensive card during cash tier format. Now it's finally been reprinted. And we have an Al Mirage dice. And we get back out. Third box, we have... Ooh. I believe that also used to be an expensive card at some points, but it, I think it's already... Um, I think it's already gotten a reprint, right? So, like, this one's not that, uh, yeah. You have to say the German names? Okay, we got Schwarz Glänzender Soldat, Soldat des Chaos. And another Almirage dice. The Magnificent Maven's Ultra is five bucks, okay, yeah. And another... We have another Finsterwaffe Drache der Zerstörung. Argue. 
and a Cyber Dragon dice. Cool. Neos Visor. And another Stratos dice. Surely we're going to get the Judgment Dragon dice any moment now. Any, any moment now. Here? Oh no, it's Big Eye. Okay. Big Eye dice and another Neos Wise Man. Pop, pop. Oops. And another Big Eye dice and another Neo. Okay. Can I stop? I don't need... Uh. Never mind. I'll just see myself out. And there's a big eye. Okay. And we did not get... Unfortunately, we did not get a Judgment Dragon dice. We have every dice exactly twice. Every dice exactly twice, but no Judgment Dragon. Big Sag. Okay. Um, I, I don't remember... I don't remember which which promos did we not get. We got number one, number two, this is number six, this is number eight, this is seven. How many different promos are there and which one did we not get? We didn't get Absolute Zero, we didn't get Cyber Slash Harpy Lady. Okay. Gamma Seal, Stratos. All right, well... Three freaking Neo's wise mans. All right. Could you show what a gold and silver ultra is? I see the rarities on cart market. Well, what are they actually? Uh, I was wondering the same thing. I I am trying to find out because just for context, hold up. Let me bring this up. So I I did go on cart market this morning at some point. And I saw this, right? They have uh Ubell version 2 special silver ultra. And then there's also a regular one, I'm pretty sure. So there's different versions of these ultras. It's an ultra with silver letters. Is that is that a misprint or is that did they want that? Like is that I I because I I have never heard of that before. Like was that intentional or are they misprints? They wanted that? Okay, it's intentional. Okay, I just haven't heard of that then. Okay, well, I'll show you. We'll we'll see it now. We'll see it now, I suppose. Okay, that means we have 16 packs to go through, I believe. Eight boxes times two packs. Yep. So let us begin. I don't know the position of where... Oh, we got... We're starting off with the Denko Seka right away. Phenomenal. Uh, Let me get... Closer. Yeah, that's better. All right, we've got Denko Seka, we've got Almirage, we've got Vision Fusion, we've got Neos Knight, Water of Life, some Ninja, Common Lambda, a Sage with Eyes of Blue, and that's a uh, regular Ultra. Read them all in German. Weiser mit den blauen Augen. We've got Nummer 77, die sieben Sünden in... What is that? Oh, that is Silver Ultra. Okay, this is what it looks like. This is Silver Ultra. Okay. How do I feel about this? It's kind of cool. Kind of cool. And we've got a Minerva in the same rarity. It's kind of like a... At first I thought it was a secret rare. But it's not quite. It's like if a, if a rare and an ultra rare had a baby. Is what it is. Okay, well, we've got a common Prisma. Driver. You always pull driver. <laughs> common Diagram.
So is it is this always like this? You always get one regular ultra and two silvers? What's driver's German flavor text? Ein Psi-Soldat, der auf Lichtblitzen in die Schlacht gegen die Sicherheitskräfte zieht. Er verwendet einen autonomen Verstärker, der Psi-Hülle genannt wird. There you go. <coughs> Alright, we got Lila. RP something. Jaugen. Raid Raptor. Lestia. Wolf. Uh, Speedroid. Raid Raptor. RP's Perfumer. We've got a silver alt art boral sword dragon. Kaliber Schwert Drache. All right. And we've got a silver U belt. The silver U belt. So does every single card come in regular ultra and silver or is there like a is are certain cards only available in one? Every has both. Okay. Well, there you go. Silver U belt. And for the comments, anything that stands out. Some Phantom Knights. All right. <laughs> Vanity's Fiend, Troll Despair, Trinity. Into the Void. Oh, Mirage, White Aura Delphine. Dolphin. Okay, here we go. We've got a... Look, we're a YCS champion. We've got an Ultra Air Minerva next to the silver. This is the difference, I guess. We can show it off like this because we've pulled them in both now. There you go. Ooh, okay, that's nice. That looks nice. We've got the Silver Ultra Chaos Emperor Dragon. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And a security dragon in silver rare. Sicherheitsdrache, let's go. Double helix. Prep. There we go with increase. Raiden. Lumber. A uh, rubber band shooter, adoration, another Denko Seka, old moon coin, regular ultra rare Exiton Knight, decent card, uh, silver ultra miracle rupture, and quick launch. Okay, I feel like we're pulling decent so far. We're pulling some decent cards. There's like barely, there's like barely any like really bad cards here. Right? It's it's unless unless I'm maybe I'm high rolling, but like for the most part, a lot of these uh hollows that we're getting are decent cards. Uh dual links players don't look right now, don't look at this. We're moving on. Raiden, solar recharge, rubber band, and dimion. Third, Denko Seka, Multiply Guy. Okay, there we go. <laughs> there's the first, uh, there's the first not, not so great Ultra. Shout out to Lionheart. <laughs> e! And another U Bell. Oh, I'm glad. Oh, my camera has frozen. Unfortunate. Hold up. Uh... Let me fix that real quick. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Mm. Okay, there we are again. Yeah, my, sometimes it does that. I don't know why and when, but yeah. I'm just happy that the two U bells we've pulled so far are the same. They're both silver. There, there is nothing that would bother me more uh, 
than uh, getting a mismatching playset of U Bells, but I'm pretty sure Silver U Bell is good. It's funny because I, I think, unironically, I think the fact that the um, the fact that the U Bell support that was recently announced is is so good. I think shines a whole different light on this product because like if if you bell and i'm not saying it will be meta it might i'm not sure yet but like the fact that you bell is getting hype right now makes this product so much better right like because imagine if this product didn't exist and you bell was not reprinted at all like that would have been terrible uh lebkuchen house <laughs> Papa is machete. Thank you for the four months. Appreciate you. Visions fusion. We have a Shiksad's Held Malicious. A ooh, that's a good one. We have a number 90 Galaxy Eyes Photon Lord. We have a Nummer 90 Galaxy Augen Photonen Herr. Let's go. Uh, and a Kumongus, the Kaiju der Klebrigen Fäden. Augers. Uh, oh, 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 oh. You got blessed boxes. Maybe I'm just getting lucky, but I'm feeling like I'm pulling some pretty good cards out of this. Maybe I'm maybe I'm just being lucky right now. Uh, living fossil, anchor tops, cactus bouncer, Lila, white Marae, witch raider, and a security dragon in regular ultra. A Radeon in Silver Ultra and another Security Dragon. Okay, that's enough Security Dragons. That's enough Security Dragons, I feel like. Don't know if I needed this many. Please, German names. <laughs> All right. Uh, <clears throat> Elementarhelt Nova Master. Felis, Lichtverpflichteter Bogenschütze. Pixelsheld Dreamer. Überfall Raptor Finaler Festungsfalke. Schicksalsheld Dangerous. Uh, Raiden, Hand der Lichtverpflichteten. Erscheinung. Gaia Drache, der Donnerangreifer. <lacht> Urteilsdrache. Oh no. Gimmick Marionette Albtraum. Jubel. Dragonische Darstellung. Fossildrache Schädelgios. Weiße Aura Bihamut. Geboren aus Draconis. Okay, here we go. Nummer 75. Verblüffender Schwatzschatten. The hell? Äh, Spioral Doppelhelix. <lacht> Vorbereitung der Riten. There we go. <lacht> there we go. I'm not doing that for every single pack. I am not doing that for every pack. There's no shot. All right, another Kamungus, a silver Cyber Dragon. There's some cards that this fits very well, I feel like. Cyber Dragon might be one of them. Like, there's some cards where I'm, I think uh, it doesn't fit that well, but for some, it's really cool. Cyber Dragon's cool. And another Kaiju. There we go. Why are you buying it in German? I, I haven't bought this at all. This is sponsored by SmartGuard, sponsor of the channel. And normally, um, I'm not going to lie. I don't think it was I, I don't think it was intentional, but I'm usually I get all the stuff in English, which I do prefer uh, in case you ever wondered. I, I do prefer English cards just because uh, it, I, I personally prefer it because it's the simplest in tournaments when your opponent can read your cards. Uh, so I'm a little bit bummed out about it because I'm going to probably have to... The cards that I'm going to keep from this, I'm probably going to have to swap at some point because I prefer English cards by so much. Um, but yeah, they, I, I think usually they send it in English and this one, maybe they just grabbed the wrong one, but it's fine. Uh, we have different dimension ground in common. We have... Ooh, Alt-Art Cyber Dragon in Ultra. 
an afterburner in silver ultra, which essentially just looks like secret rare, but with a different picture on spell cards. And we have Pinsternis Metall, Drache des Dunkelstahls, uh, which I think is the red eyes link. Lumina, Adoration, Into the Void, Golden Moon Coin, Al Mirage, Gravido, Order of Life, and there's the same link again. We have a Silver x like this one for example, I feel like it suits so much better. The fact that it's silver, it looks better than the Golden. I feel like. And then we have another Sage of Blue. Lila, Felis, Witch Raider, Gingerbread House. There we go. We've got Big U Bell as a regular Ultra. Uh, another Silver Minerva and another Kaiju. Is there? It doesn't feel like there's that many different like Hollows in this. I feel like we're getting a decent amount of repeats. I mean, we have a playset of U Bells already. There's only 36 different holes? Okay. No whale yet? Oh, is the white aura whale also a hollow? There's our fourth freaking security dragon. We've got Orgoth in a in a silver and oh, dude! Stop with the security dragons! How many is that? Six? Or five. Five! I don't need any more security dragons, please. Lila, White Moray, Lambda, Adoration, Hagen, Minimum Ray. Oh! Spoilers, Miracle Rupture in Ultra. Second form of U-Bell. So we've pulled all the forms of U-Bell, which is pretty cool. And another Orgoth. Okay, I feel like I could have survived this opening without pulling Orgoth. You don't need to, like, give me multiples in the last couple packs. I was fine without it. No, I feel pretty secure now. Uh, I feel pretty secure now, but... <laughs> Stop with the security dragons, man. Okay, we have ju Judgment Dragon. And this is the last pack already. Okay. We've been zooming through these. This is the last chance at the Utopia for any believers. Don't know what the odds are for pulling it, but it needs to happen now. And uh, Lionheart is not Utopia. Not oh my god. Lionheart, Lionheart, Minerva. Okay, I don't... That was not a banger as the last pack. Okay, I mean... Overall, though... um, Not too bad. I feel like I want to say what are like, okay. I actually don't know. I am curious. What are the, what are good pulls? Like, what are the good pulls in this? Are the U-Bell cards all good pulls? Are they all right? U-Bell is solid. Um... Dude, I'm sorry, the... Can you even hear that? 
I can barely hear that. I'm sorry, Toxic Rain. Seeing all these German cards made me remember I, for some reason, learned German in my primary school in Australia. Well, what do you mean for some reason? I'm pretty sure the reason was to learn German. Isn't that the reason you learn any language? I could hear that. Okay, then it might be might be louder for you guys than it is for me because I had to read it. But uh, thank you for the bits. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Like, I mean, gimmick puppet, I guess, is a solid pull. This is a solid pull. This is a solid pull. Yeah, I mean, I'm not feeling too bad about it. I expected I expected this opening to go worse when I initially saw the set. I'm not going to lie. Like there's a there's a bunch of decent cards in here. 